Photographer Karsten Peter always needs a red-hot adrenaline rush, and he finds it coming face-to-face -face with Earth's volcanoes. It's something like my religion. Yeah, I depend on the volcanoes. Yeah, I'm addicted to the volcanoes. To feed that addiction, Karsten and his team traveled to Ambrim, a remote island in the South Pacific. Almost 1,200 feet or 360 meters below the surface lies the Maroon Crater. One of Earth's rarest phenomenons, it is a lake of molten lava. Karsten has come to capture this inferno's tremendous size and power by descending into the boiling Earth. The hardened lava is their biggest danger yet. Every edge, every corner could be disastrous for the rope. The rope goes upwards, downwards, and, and it will easily be cut because the volcanic rocks are very sharp. Karsten is obsessed, photographing his beloved volcanoes, even on the descent. Finally, he stands on a ledge above the lake of boiling magma. If you step one step too much over your limits, it, it could be your, your last step. The lava's temperature rockets to 1,000 degrees Celsius, or nearly 2,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Karsten braves the heat that can melt solid rock. Volcanic eruptions are the most powerful events here on, on Earth. It's like witnessing the creation of a planet. From the bottom of the inferno, Karsten struggles to show Maroon's awesome force. He suddenly realizes how to create that image, but needs help. He turns to his partner and volcanologist, Frank Tessier. I saw Frank down there in, in uh, close to that pit and, and I, I just couldn't believe it, him and the comparison to this huge vent. But I needed him to climb up a little higher. I don't know if it's possible, maybe for two minutes again. Uh... He barely could understand myself because it was so loud and so noisy. A gust of hot gas could erase Frank to nothing. Still, he carefully inches along the ridge until silhouetted by the belching vent. For Karsten and Frank, getting that shot is a risk worth taking, even in the danger zone. In this extreme moment, Karsten manages to show man's frailty against Earth's ferocious power. If there is no one in the frame, you don't have any comparison and, and you are lost in the scale. And that's the important touch to that image. 